father. Daughter, you are just in time. I am about to set in motion a chain of events that will forever change the history of the planet Earth. He will try to stop you, will he not? I have already anticipated his involvement. If all goes according to plan, you will see him soon enough. Yes, my lord. It is time. Begin the second phase of the operation. Yes, my lord. Hello ladies and gentlemen, I am JC from MySpace, and today we are going to be playing Batman Dark Tomorrow. So I uploaded this video um, the other day, and I was, I was playing it on my PC through an emulator, and it was just, it was so, so bad. So what I did is I actually went out and bought the game, had to order it, and uh, came into the day, and I'm playing it through my Wii. So, everything's a lot better. The graphics are a little better than they would be on an emulator. The uh, sound is not all crinkly and everything. It should be pretty crisp. 
So I'm probably going to delete that other video and Oracle. have this one up instead, obviously. From? Unknown. Whoever sent this was good. From what I could translate, the message spoke of a large arms shipment. Good work. Find the origin of that satellite transmission and who sent it. You got it, boss. Batman out. As with most of the games that I play, I'm going to try to talk as little as possible through cutscenes because I enjoy cutscenes and I assume a bunch of you guys out there do. Um, so, I, I'm going to say a lot of things I said in the other video. This is called Batman Dark Tomorrow and it's supposedly the worst Batman game ever made. So, I mean, I've played a little bit of it, obviously, you know, because I did the first video and it... it just playing on an emulator is not good, because emulators, they aren't always up to snuff, I guess, is the word to use. And so, playing it like this is just a lot better. I have a Wii, so, you know, why not try to use it to the best of my abilities? Uh, am I stuck? What's happening here? I can't see. Um, so, a couple things about this game. I'm going to try to make this as, you know, not so much a review as is a let's play, because I actually plan to play this whole game to completion, um, but we'll see how that works out. Um, so like I said, this is supposedly the worst Batman game ever made, and there are a couple things that kind of, you know, back up that claim. The controls themselves aren't super crisp, um, there's a lot of things that Batman does that, you know, I would not do, controller-wise, and the camera angles are a big pain in the ass because they're a little reminiscent of Resident Evil camera angles, whereas it's a fixed camera and you can't move it, and that definitely gets a little annoying at times, like, see, I'm running right here, and then, boom, camera change. That can really fuck you up at times, especially, you know, if you're in a fight, and that's another thing about the game that's a little harder is the combat system isn't, you know, the best. It's a little laggy. But, I mean, other than that, a couple of good things about this game. The soundtrack so far is... I love it. It sounds great. And the way Batman himself looks is, you know, he looks like Batman. He doesn't look stupid. He's not over the top. He's very reminiscent of what the comic book Catman... Catman, goddammit, this is not Fairly Odd Parents. Batman is supposed to look like. I mean, there's nothing flashy about him. It's, it's Batman. And his cape is actually really cool. I mean, look at that. It, it flows pretty well. I mean, there's a lot of attention to that. Um, and the cutscenes are another thing that were highly praised about this game. Um, so, I mean, yeah, I mean, it's definitely so far, I mean, I've gotten pretty, f not, okay, the words are hard. I played a little bit of it, and I didn't get super far, because I didn't want to, you know, play too much at once. But, um, I got to a decent stopping point earlier. And I see this one thing that's going to happen is I'm going to die a lot because of how the controls are done. I'm, pl I'm not playing with an actual GameCube controller. This is a uh, an aftermarket GameCube controller because I never actually owned a GameCube. So, oh, uh, that's one thing that also sucks. If you die, you go back pretty fucking far. Can I, can I make, I don't think I can make that jump. I definitely cannot make that jump. So I'm going to go back up here. But no, I mean, I'm a huge Batman fan, and from what I've played, I don't want that, whoops. From what I've played so far, it's not the worst game ever, you know, Superman 64 was a lot worse. I mean, Superman 64 was just bad, I mean, anyone that played it can attest to how bad that game was. This, I think, is a very good improvement upon that. So, I'm gonna stop we're going to try to stop talking about this, you know, more in a review manner and more of in a let's play, you know, let's, let's have fun and watch me die 10 billion times manner. Jump. Batman, jump. Get up there. Come on. There we go. Oh, how the fuck am I going to do this? I guess maybe I could jump and grapple? God damn it. Get there. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh my god, come on.
See, that, see what I mean about the, the controls not being, you know, super crisp? But I mean, that, that's okay. At the time it was made, it, it does a good... Oh god, what's happening? Oh my god, he jumped right over the bridge. Sweet babies. And that's just one thing that sucks about the, you know, the camera angles they use. Okay, I have to be standing still to throw the back grapple. On the back cable. Oh, that would've been so cool. Oh, I fucked it up so bad. Balls in my mouth and around that general area. Oh yeah, I have, I have a Mountain Dew in here. Approach getting a little scratchy. Deliciously watered down Mountain Dew. I just smacked my microphone. Y'all probably heard that. I said y'all. I hate everything about me. Don't you do it, man. Don't you fuck this up. Oh, you made it. Good boy. Okay, let's not jump. I'm so not used to a GameCube controller layout. It's so different. I have Smash Brothers somewhere. I need to find that. So I'm just going to try to play this as safe as possible and uh, hopefully make this jump. Or, you know, fall to my god diggity daffodil death. Shit tacos. That's like, what, four deaths now? And I've only been recording for 12 minutes. I kind of bought this game with the intention of it being a possible rage game as well, just because, I mean, so far it's not boding too well for me. Do, 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 do. I'm Batman. Oh, he doesn't do the double jump when I want him to do the double jump. Feces. There's a speck on my webcam that's gonna bother me. If I keep dying, I'm just gonna do a bunch of jump cuts. If not, then I obviously won't do that. But. You guys don't need to see me die 10 trillion times. Come on, Batsy. Come on, Batsy. Come on. Is there, is there an easier way? What is this? I guess that's just my steery. Steery? My swingy. There's gotta be an easier way to do this, like... Just derp derp. I guess like that. Son of a bitch. I am not a clever man. We're making some progress now. Commissioner. God, that took a lot longer than it should have. Must you do that every time? What's wrong? We've reported a massive down, Jim. shootout in Gazette Square. I have a heart attack. The reports also say that the gunmen are wearing elaborate masks. Black Mask and his gang of false facers. And that they're fighting against a lunatic holding a wooden dummy. Scarface and the ventriloquist. Another turf war. I'm afraid it's worse than that. Oh, the fans kind of some drying of these clowns got a hold of some pretty high-tech weaponry. Military-grade stuff. Understood. I'm on it. And another cool thing about this game is the fact that... that came from Batman actually sounds like Dispatch. Batman. This is the commissioner. Radio the task force and tell them to report to If you guys if any of you guys watch the uh, the Dark Knight Returns uh animated movies, good luck. They're fantastic movies, but the one or thing I have against them is how Batman sounded. Of a gang war near Gazette Square. I mean, I realize he was older, but he sounded like a granddad. Registered on all of my sensors. Watch out for structural damage to some of the older buildings. Yeah. And thank God like he doesn't sound like Christian Bale. Has gotten the upper hand and has taken control of the surrounding area. Keep me updated. Batman out. Have fun. That loading screen, though. So we're going to the Gotham City alleyway. Let's see how this works. This is a uh, close to the area where I stopped last time. Oh my God, those bullets! Now you see the combat system here. It's a little, uh, at least a little bit to be desired. No, put that down. Or, or my, where's my back cuffs? Or I swear to God, they look like zip ties. Ow, you dick! Now you see, 
I don't know if a lot of people know this game exists, really, because I think they tried to cover it up as much as possible. But the combat system, it, it does leave a lot to be desired. I mean, it's really just straightforward punch, kick. There's not a whole lot to it. There's no, as far as I'm aware, there's no blocking. There's no countering that's going to happen. So so I guess that green dot there might be a, uh, a bad guy. I haven't quite figured this out. Back rubble does no good. So I'm probably going to get my uh, face shot in here. Or is that... Oh, that's an RPD. RPD? RPG. RPD is a gun, sorry. Come on, bat. Jump up there. Or climb. I don't care how you do it. Just get up there. God, you're Batman. Come on. I'm Batman. I'll come back for you. I gotta put this guy in cuffs first. But seriously, they look like zip ties, don't they? Can you walk? Thank you. Walk through the door. I hate this fixed camera stuff, though. How do I go through? I guess I... Okay. No? I have a, I have this thing, though. Oh, wait. That's the wrong button. Did it unlock the door for me? Guess not. Okay, that sucks. Can I go through this door? I can punch that door. What's this way? It's out here. Okay, that door's open. I read up that the multi-tool could also be used to pick locks, and apparently that's not true. <laughs> that makes me sad. I'm gonna kick you, and you're gonna... Ow! Son of a bitch! That's an explosive car. Get up, man. Come on. You're Batman. You don't lay on your back and take it like that. Ow! Those are... Okay, I'm fucking dead. Ah, oh, that sucked. There's going to be a lot of game over screams. Batman. So I'm going to go this way this time. And hope I don't get shot. Can't punch that. Oh, oh, he sees me. How do I, how, how, how do I lay flat like a snake? Like that. That's the lay flat like a snake button. I'm gonna need you to, Batman, can you look around the corner for me? No? Okay, never mind. Keep running, huh? Oh, fire! Don't run into. I swear to God, you ran right into the fire. If you can not do that, Bruce. This city belongs to me. You have no idea what you're up against, Scarface. And I'm sorry, Black Mass just looks so funny to me now after playing Arkham Origins. Now. Batman. Where did you get the weapons? You don't scare me, Bats. You don't scare me. Gazette Square. A little bit of lag there. Oh, it's a little bit, a little laggy right here. No, let it go. Don't do that. Why do I have to cuff them every time? Get the fuck back down. I mean, it, it's a cool mechanic. It's a different mechanic. I don't remember Batman using handcuffs in any of the other games. Oh, come on. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't put bullets in me. There's a lot going on here. A little bit of an overload, it looks like. Put cuffs on you. Put 
cuss on you. Now, see, I turned my fan off, and now I'm fucking burning up. Oh, bitch, get out of the way. Lay flat like a snake. Lay flat like a snake, Batman. Or don't. You're gonna get shot up if you don't lay flat like a snake. Ow, he just, like, kicked me in the shin. You're a dick. That's a terrifying fucking mask. Okay, we're making some good progress, it looks like. I'm gonna get shot against the wall. A way to block would be nice. I don't, I don't, I don't know how I'd block bullets, but it would have been appreciated nonetheless. They even sound like zip ties. Oh, hi. You just face through me. That's cool. Oh, those will fuck your mouth open. Okay, I thought I walked right into one. I should be really pissed off. Sir? Sir? Oh my god, I'm gonna get kicked while trying to zip tie your friend. I don't appreciate that at all. You get a zip tie, and you get a zip tie, and you get a zip tie. Everybody gets zip ties. Are they in here? Is this what party's at? Looks like it. Oh god, why is. Oh god, why is there. Fu How do I do? Can I leave? I can't leave. I have fucked myself. Ow, bad. Maybe this where you the muscle tool. Nope, he just pulled it out and dicks with it. Okay, so guys, just in case you didn't know, punching uh, panels on the wall makes the sprinklers go off. Go out, go off. So, is there a fire or just punch the nearest electrical thing you find? And hopefully there'll be water. So if I punch it again, does the water turn off? No, just water forever? Okay, that's cool. So, why am I in here again? I guess I'm going behind the counter. No? I'm just I'm just in here, huh? Oh, there's a thing over there! Oh, hey, it went out. Give me the, give it to me. I need that. Hints. Bonus item. Hidden throughout the game are CDs and discs. Oh, god damn, I was reading that. Okay, can I leave now? Am I done in here? Okay, just... <laughs> Being violent fixes all your problems. However, Batman can't open a door. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't understand how that worked. He hit it like three times and just reached for it and opened it. Oh my god, and I just ran right into a, a freaking... I'm, I'm gonna die. I need... Use a medical kit, Batman. I am not... Good at this. Okay, you have a hostage. What do I what do I, what do I do about that? I, I assume I throw a batarang at you, but Batman, I need you to take cover. Oh my god. Thank you for that. So apparently if I assume Stop! Fucking A! Fuck the fuck off. I think this is where I died last time, actually. And then I stopped playing. I need you to walk into the, uh, the place that we're going. Oh my god, it's just bullets. It's just a barrage, barrage of fuck you bullets everywhere. Ow, I just got kicked in the dick. I literally just got kicked in the bat dick. Did it again. Y'all are dicks. I said it again. I'm trying to suppress my oaky instinct to say y'all. It's not working. Did I get them all? Did I, did I do the good bat? I did the good bat. Okay. So this is further than I got last time. If I punch this door, will it move? No? Okay. Um, 
What am I doing here? Can I go through here? Just in, in, in the door? No. Okay. The fixed camera angle is just really fuck every. Okay, if you. I don't understand. <laughs> I don't understand how this works. Oh, it is a it is a warm summer's day in here, and we're not even in summer yet. So I'm definitely not gonna do the whole like one whole chapter per video because that is a uh, not gonna work. Oh God, they're right there. They see me. Oh, there's four of them. They all see me, and their bullets also see me. I am not gonna make it here. I am not gonna. I'm not gonna do well. Did not do well. That sucked. Okay, well, we're about almost 30 minutes in. So, I think I'm going to call this episode here. Um, this is Batman Dark Tomorrow. I will be attempting a full playthrough of this game. Because, I mean, I've played every other Batman game that's come out within the past... Uh, since 2009 when Arkham Asylum came out. And I had never heard of this game. And I looked it up, and it literally got like a 1 out of 10. So I'm going to see if it's really as bad as uh, the reviews gave it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, subscribe, you know, leave a comment, like, share it with your friends. I really appreciate it. And I will see you guys later. So bye-bye.